Down sport timey kangaroo down. Yeah, and you gotta stop, they're gonna, gonna get a copyright strike. Baby kangaroo, baby kangaroo. One Direction owns that song right now. No, careful. the Woggles does. Baby shark doo doo. No. Oh, good. Pink Fong has sued us. That's how we, that's it. That'd be great if that's the last episode. For one billion dollars. Pink Fong's like, you're done! You're done! <laughs> guys, welcome to Inside the Ant Farm. We you have a in. fantastic beer, guys. It smells yeah. great. I can't oh wait to drink it. I'm actually listening uh, to Barrel Age, Innocent Gun, Irish Whiskey Cask. Whiskey. Irish. Full Irish. Irish. This might even be up by uh, St. Patty's Day. Who knows? Mm. I don't believe that. Oh. That's so good. Mm. Mm. Oh, it's mm. well, well balanced beer. Well aged, yes. So how are you guys doing? What's up? What's up, everyone? Steno and Sun over here. Um, Eat trash. Hail Satan. They oh, first saw us and he thought, he thought it was Stun Owen Stun. He thought it was Owen Hart. I was like, oh, oh. I guess you got wrestling at least. Who yeah. is this? Uh, Big Bird. Oh. <laughs> is that Owen Hart? Charge my passes. Uh, he, used to watch, he used to watch wrestling in the 80s, 90s, so yeah. that's like he's still, that's his favorite. Like, is, is Owen Hart still out? Like, oh. <laughs> he has a big ECW mark, too. <laughs> no, he knows, he knows he's, he died. How, is the not... Sandman still out? No, 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 no. <laughs> he's alive, though, at least, I think. Sandman is still alive. He was on Dark Side of the Ring, actually. So. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he was. We watched all those. Was, it was, and they're I, dark. Bet, I bet there was nothing dark about his. He was episode. talking about New Jack City. No, he was talking about New Jack. The, the murder man? New yeah. Jack? Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. He's, He's like, like, oh yeah, that guy, you like, yeah. really got me this part too <laughs> <Yeah>. much. He's <laughs> like, I just want to smoke a cigarette and like go out and beat someone with yeah. a kendo stick. He was like, I want to kill you, literally. <laughs> literally, I will try to kill you. Uh, Cocaine, you guys, it's really bad. It's a hell of a drug. <laughs> also, his head looked, like, New Jack's head looked, oh my god, okay, let's not talk about that. I'm doing great, though. Yeah? We I can know. talk about wrestling. I my, mean, my car, though, is being super weird right now. Heads. And we, like, brought... The car in uh, to the dealer because we have a warranty with the dealer, and like they, they they they'll do the work and like they'll charge you for like what's not under warranty. Like, so we get a little less sometimes. We have we have a great mechanic and that's and that's the sad part here. So we brought it in because there's like a little noise and then and then they're just like, yeah, we fixed it and they get back to us and, and they're like, <laughs> like okay, so not fixed. Yeah. Did you like try maybe turning right because yeah. we yeah. just did that? Yeah. And no. No, I hate that. Like, you should definitely take a test drive with yeah. the car. I don't care if you, you drive my it. car as long as you make sure it's fixed. Yeah. You don't have to come back. No, I literally had this. It was mine was a Subaru too, and it was like <sighs> basically he was like, oh, we'll fix this problem. Oh wait, no, it's another problem. Oh wait, it's another problem. I'm like, how? So you just fix things until you get to the real problem? Like, how do I get this? Like, fixed? we fix all problems with this swingy hammer we have. Yeah, exactly. Swingy hammer. Like, okay, okay. And no. so, so yeah, so Hammer, bro- Hammer Brothers. Oh, the thing is, it's like I don't, I can't like take off work. So right. like I, I'm just we we're, either we we're gonna like try and roll the car in there in the morning at some point, and then just not have a car all weekend, which fucking sucks. Or we have to like figure something else out. I mean, you're near Shop City, so you can if you need anything, go to the dollar store. That's true. You. Uh, the thing is, we like because this the first time we brought in was last set was last Friday, and then we didn't have it for the full weekend, and right. we're like we're like kids, you're going to the zoo this weekend. Yeah. Luckily, kids don't remember shit. Yeah, yeah. So like, <laughs> like, it's like we didn't say that. <laughs> no, like, I feel so bad because I was gonna say we could help you guys out this weekend, but like we're going out of town oh, for know. a romantic oh, weekend. Oh, I know. So we have humble brag over here. Yeah, like. Yeah, we have well, so he's right. COVID proof now. COVID proof. What? What? COVID, COVID proof. proof. What? What? No, I kind of wish I had like a prop gun, so I'd just be like, are you COVID yeah. proof? And COVID! Just, yeah. Fire away yeah. with your COVID um, germs. So we're going to go to the Finger Lakes and drink some wine, eat some food, drive around, see some stuff. I'm super excited. I don't understand this thing called romance. I don't even know what that means. I didn't realize it until I was 35 years old, so... Wait, that's how old you are now. Wait, so you... Am I? Am I 35? Yeah. I am. Wait, I hope so. <laughs> so. I was like, so what, you didn't realize 33 years, years ago? Three, no, three. No, what the hell? That would be a weird setup if you were like, I'm actually 28. <laughs> yeah. I, what? He finally <laughs> started to <laughs> me <Yeah>. romance. Yeah. <laughs> okay, in the future, we should be going to show me what romance is. <laughs> Damn. So, that's harsh. Sometimes it takes time. Sometimes your kids just have to get older so you can... <sighs> You know, not have them hanging on It takes so long, every, though. It but, takes oh, so it takes long. so long. <laughs> and it you know what, guys? So <laughs> I'm fine, too. Let's get some news, okay? News. So no one's stuck. Yeah. News. So no one's stuck. Guys, D&D. Hmm. 
Alright, are you excited to get another Dungeons Dragons video game? What? I wrote this down because uh, uh, it's yeah. awesome. Yeah. yeah. Third person open world RPG based in the Dungeons Dragons uh, universe. Well, this could yeah. be a AAA game too. Okay. Uh, from a, from a newer studio called Hidden Paths Entertainment. Uh, they're going to use the Unreal 4 engine, which is a great engine. Uh, looks, you can make really realistic uh, yeah. designs. Hidden stuff. Path is actually, they did uh, uh, Global Strike, uh, Counter Strike. Uh, Counter Strike, yeah, yeah. They, they worked global. on it. They, they weren't the, the full developer for it, but they did like a lot of work on it. And uh, I, I'm excited. I, I like a lot of these smaller studios trying to step into the kind of the gaps left by a lot of these AAA studios that aren't just, just aren't doing yeah, something. Yeah, like, Bioware, Bioware being just taken just apart because, mind. yeah. Yeah. Um, and you know, then hidden. Then we can look forward to ten years. Hidden Path being bought up by EA and, and turned into like a mm -hmm. studio that makes uh, the Candy Crush games. Yeah. Sure. <laughs> like, oh, Candy Crush show. Uh, Candy Crush, Crush D and D. It just makes microtransactions. Like, oh, <laughs> but I have a blue hat for my microtransaction. <laughs> like, uh, I need fifteen dollars for this blue hat for my character. Mm. What does your character do? He's a wizard of some sort with a blue hat. Duh. Yeah. I, I just know. told you. Yeah. I need fifteen dollars for that hat. Um, but uh, yeah, so the uh, possible wire release because they did talk about like um, doing uh, hiring someone for like console, uh, console like um, con not con consulta consultation, like a console consultation. Mm -hmm. That's a consultant. Really yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes, a consultant for console and an stuff sure. and uh, narrative branching story path. So like very, very it sounds like a very like proto so like dragon Bioware. Age. Yeah, yeah, very proto Bioware, yeah. which I love. I I'm down for. It. We mm -hmm. need more games like yeah. that. Having a choice like that in the game, uh, you know, gives a lot of replayability. It gives a lot of good choice. Like, if you can make your character, instead of just be like, I am definitely the hero. I was mm, righteous, which this guy always played with. But, but you could be like, I'm a jerk. You know, You're I'm a white knight? Is that right? I'm, I'm Are you going to be a jerk if you play this game? Uh, it depends, depends on the story. Because, like, like uh, as you, you like and I both lawful, know. Like lawful, lawful good. Well, as you and I both know, like, I, I'm usually, I'm usually kind of good myself. But, uh, but... It, as 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 uh, Matt and I both know, and, and Kitty will know soon, because you're gonna watch him play the, uh, the the new Mass Effect. And okay. Mass Effect being a jerk is fun. I <laughs> know about Mass Effect. Do you? Know? I do. She watched and it. You know already. Not yeah, so I know stuff. See, see, being a jerk is fun. It is. She knows you keep the Edar 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 Yashi. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's right. Or, or or that one guy that's just standing there like being a jerk. You just take that take that uh. Electric pride and hit and shoot him with it. I feel like bunning people with guns a lot. Like, I know Seth Green is like the best pilot. And he has Rolex syndrome. Yeah. Bird bones. Bird old bird bones. Uh, yeah. I I mean that's all I got for that, but I I still am very excited about that. Yeah. There's not really any uh date for how the game's moving along. It's just been green lit. Uh, so I have another uh. I don't know about alien Related D and D. Oh God, uh, guys, get me wet. Tonight. If you're like, if you're like, who do you want in your D and D movie? Mm. What's the first choice? Hugh Grant. Laura Birch, because she was in the first one. <laughs> Hugh Grant over here oh, is <laughs> cast as a main antagonist. <laughs> Hugh Grant, main antagonist. He's in this. Uh, oh, no, man. uh. Divine main Brown. antagonist. No, 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 I'm not kidding. Hugh Grant is the main oh, antagonist. Oh, did you look this up? Yes. I oh. Divine <laughs> uh, so Brown is obviously the protagonist, so th that's going to be the... But you guys, okay. this uh, is the heel turn we've been waiting for, like, literally fucking 20 years. So, so by the by the way, if, if you're looking for a, a great Hugh Grant heel turn, watch The Undoing on HBO Max. It's the Undoing. Or awesome. just watch um, awesome. that 2020, what was it, the... I hate twenty twenty or oh the uh, the Netflix uh, docu mockumentary about the year twenty twenty. Yeah, where there. he plays like a racist old British guy. Yeah, it was pretty great. <laughs> it so was played, amazing. So, yeah, yeah so he plays the but you guys, this is what we've been waiting for. Like, like no, none of us believed him as the charming British man, no. like ever, no, right? Ever. Like we no. all knew. No, uh, yeah. Tipper and Love actually, where he was oh, just yeah. oh, oh, yeah. uh, Sophia, <laughs> Sophia Lily has also signed okay, on. Sure. Uh, um, a younger British actress. Yep, I like her. Uh, I think she's British anyway. Uh, so. Uh, so She's in an unnamed role, but she's joining the likes of Chris Pine, what? Michelle Rodriguez, what? Justice Smith, and Reggie Jean Page, of course, who we talked about last week. Wow, that's canonically stacked. canonically to this podcast. Can we just go stacked? Uh, the, date, the date is still uh, is still stuck at uh, May twenty seventh, twenty twenty in theaters. Twenty twenty two in theaters. So. I'm like last year. Last year. 
year it came out already. <laughs> last year. It already came out. May 2021? We're That's going back to, to, to the future to, to watch this movie. Okay. Yeah, they just cast you. There's no way they're getting this. I thing. mean, basically, if you say Michelle Rodriguez... And unless they're unless you're just doing a, like, a Let's Play and they're going to do like a... Yeah. <laughs> not like Brendan Lee Mulligan give you the DM or something. That's not right. Yeah. Uh, but but, but also yeah. Michelle Rodriguez, so... Like, yeah, that's right. Oh, Vin Diesel did the DM. Okay, so so let's let I what I um, thought what I thought could be fun is let's Michelle let's, Rodriguez let's, is more like this. Let's put classes on all these on all these actors. Okay. okay. So so if Hugh Grant obviously gonna be a wizard, mm-hmm. right? Like he's got a right. pedophile. What? It's, it's what? not a class. Pedophiles that made you made you thinking of cyberpunk. Um, mm-hmm. Too many documentaries. <laughs> you, you think of the next thing called uh, the next thing <laughs> yeah. called. Um, you, you yeah. grant wizard, obviously. Mm-hmm. Wizard. Full mm-hmm. wizard. Like, mm-hmm. you know he's not wizard. Um, he's a rogue. Chris Pine, though. Hello, I'm Chris Pine. I'm, excuse me, I'm a rogue. I will stab you with my backstab. Chris Pine, though, man. Chris Pine. So, Chris mm-hmm. Pine could be, like... Paladin. No, I... Paladin. No, I feel like he's gonna be, like, a... Oh. Warlock? No! Fighter? Ranger? No. I'm no. trying to give you classes. Druid? No. Don't no. say druid. Monk? No. A monk? Ooh. No. Uh, barbarian? No. Uh, a sorcerer? We're running out of classes here. Um, you know, is he going to be a gnome? <laughs> that's I mean, that's not a class. I guess, I class. I'm not sure what's going on I'm, here. I, I, that would, he'd be an amazing gnome, though. He'd be so hey, good. Hey guys, it's me. I yeah. got a big I had the list. biggest lips of any gnome ever. <laughs> but he'd be a gnome that like takes over, he'd be a person that takes over a gnome's body. And he'd be like a, a troubadour. Like a troubadour or something like that. A like bard. A, yeah, a he's bard. a bard. Okay. Yeah. No. Okay, there you go. 100%. Chris Pine is a bard. Okay. No. Yes, 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 I, yes, 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 yes. Oh, I'll do it. Uh, how about Michelle Rodriguez? Michelle Rodriguez. Oh, she's a fighter. Or a pilot. Like, oh, she's, she's yeah, definitely, not, not yeah. Paladin. Not, not yeah. Paladin. Yeah, fighter, fighter, fighter. Justice Smith. I don't even know who this person is. Is that Will Smith's? No. Yes. <laughs> well, we're going to say One of them, one of them. It's the third, Justice the third. Smith. Everyone the third with, with Smith as the last name is related to Will Smith. <laughs> <laughs> That's how it is now. Justice Smith is Will Smith's other persona. He's yeah. Like, I'm Justice <laughs> Smith. <laughs> Paladin. Oh, yeah, 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 like Justice. Yeah, yeah. You're like yeah, William Justice. Yeah, yeah. I'll, be, yeah. I'll give that to you. I feel yeah. you have um, to be. Ray G. Jean Page, guys, from Bridgerton. Oh, I didn't That's watch Bridgerton. He's a smoke show. Did you watch SNL lately? Because he was on that. So he could be like a barbarian. Oh, he could be, a, I don't yeah. know. He'd be the paladin. Warlock. He's the paladin. Warlock. Warlock? Ooh. What do you think? What? No. Kara, charisma is the major stat. Charisma? Charisma. Charisma. I was going to say charismatic, but I was just saying. He's the ranger then. Uh, Ranger could be uh, um, Sophie, Sophia. Tracy no, Morgan. she's like a monk, maybe. Tracy Morgan. Tracy He's Morgan. Like, I'm, I'm a ranger. <laughs> <laughs> there is a thirty rock episode where he has like the whole elf garb going on. So Ranger, I'm trying to think of how we can make that into the title of the episode. <laughs> no. Tracy Morgan. Um, uh, okay, and that's all I got for that. Yeah, I, that sure. stretched it out a lot. I'm ready. Yeah, Let's was, bring it on. Pretty long. Bring it on. <laughs> this episode will D&D be D and D should be long. Hey guys. Speaking of too long, uh, Warner Ooh. Brothers CEO has broad strokes like, oh, the next movie. 40 years of uh, Harry Potter. Uh, oh my god. You know, How excited are you about this, man? Uh, <laughs> he said there's plenty of room for expansion. Yeah. And he's like, w- without, w- without J.K. Rollins. <laughs> uh, well, no, he said J.K. Rollins has, he has their blessing and she's going to be helping. They she won't cancel be ri- her. She won't be writing good trans she's not, parts. She's not, <laughs> yeah, there will be no trans characters. Uh, but she hasn't canceled it, so that's good, and we haven't canceled her, right? I don't, right? like, I right? just don't, I don't, I, I, I bet love... you J.K. Rowling does write a trans character and then Listen, murders a trans character. Listen, I love Harry Potter. All right, we're getting down, like, deep here. I read the fourth book it, it in, we, I read the fourth wow. book in a day. That oh, book is wow. thick. Wow. I read that book in a day, no, okay? No. I was Great obsessed book. with Harry Potter. I read them as they came out. I love them. Like, just don't kick a fucking dead horse. Like, let yeah, it go. Like, to... aren't they remaking the the original ones Lucky already? Eyes? Yeah. Lucky like, oh god. Oh, did you you saw the DVDs I sent to you, right? I got left behind and hey, Judgment. No, the no, no. Focus. Oh, right, sorry. Harry Potter. Did you watch Left Behind already? No, we watched the Nicolas Cage one. Focus. We're talking this about Harry Potter. This is the Kirk Cameron one. Focus. We're talking <laughs> about Harry Potter. Okay. Okay. So the CEO obviously likes money sure. and is trying to yeah. print money with the sure. Harry Potter franchise. When do we get the tales of Beale Bard? He wants green dots, right? When do we get a show about the tales of? No, Beale Bard? I don't. Okay, it'd have to be like a seven an series animated show. show. It's yeah. an animated show. Yeah. What is like a Muppet Baby type thing? What's a little beetle? Like little beetle. Little beetle bard. Well, yeah. beetle bard can be a little beetle. It's fine. Like we don't know what size he is. 
Well, no, he's a dude. It's a, he's an actual man that. Yeah, but he could be. That universe. He could be a cartoon baby for all we know. We That's know. what I'm saying. Like, make him a cartoon baby. I have the book in there. there. You can read it anytime you want. I'm not going to do that right now. We're just we're just doing right. a show. I'm just saying. <laughs> what if that was part Educate of the show? Educate yourself. Oh, guys, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll be back when we don't read. It's reading rainbow. <laughs> Educate yourself about a fictional book. Yeah. A children's yeah. story. Yeah. Well, you're talking about it because. I'm like talking about the broad they're keep strokes. Making the, the broad, broad strokes. strokes. They could just do fun. the history of Dumbledore. Like, wouldn't we all watch that? Dumbledore. Yeah. They're basically trying to do that with uh, the Fantastic Beasts. He's kind of like the sure. like the secondary plot. Guys, speaking of like magic being real in the world. Yeah. Old Ed smart tattoos are a reality. What? Glow glowing smart yeah. tattoos. There, are a thing there we is a. Do. There is. Wait, a, didn't you get injected with that when you got the vaccine? No, that's the microchip where you can find me. The five my tail app. Five G. Find my tail app. Um, no, I've I've actually seen this kind of ink before. It's like a glow in the dark, um, uh, phosphorescent ink. No, you're wrong. This is something much different. So okay. this is like literally liquid liquid electronic display that reacts to certain stimuli. Uh, it's not. It's not. This is not an actual thing that can go under your skin yet. It yeah. is not, it's more like a temporary tattoo. So say it's, it's not a permanent tattoo. Uh, yeah, no, no, no. But it is, it, they, it is a tattoo. Right? So, like, uh, if but, you're excited and you put a tattoo down here, it'll, like, glow? Yes. That is actually <laughs> one of the applications. Of it. They, they, so, they basically, the people that invent this are like, I don't need a tattoo to know that. <laughs> like, like we, we, can, we, can have, uh, we can have it so, like, an athlete is dehydrated, it will say, because he won't, like, his moisture will be sweating, you know, and it'll, right. it'll make it Or athlete. if a criminal's lying. It'll or say. or yeah. it, if someone's about to get sunburned, it will. It will or if they're Jewish, oh, I don't need it'll that. say, Jew, I'm I don't just, like this. Oh, oh, that is. I don't like the application of this. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm already red, reticent about this. It's, just, it's already being able to be. Uh, pretty cheaply made. Uh, it is just like like a temporary tattoo where you literally put water and then like stick it to yourself. Yeah. Um, but it also is something they can do with like expiration dates on food, so you can like just pick up the food and it'd be like glowing like it expires in five so days. Are we know? getting each other one of these temporary tattoos for Christmas? Like just so like radium, you know. like when and radium came out and it made everything glow, and we were like put radium on everything, I and then we said that OLEDs don't do that. It gives you cancer. <laughs> Like, it gives you cancer? They're just said that don't do that. Yeah, yeah. Like, 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 obviously, maybe. we all would have cancer right now if that yeah. was the case. But, uh, it's, it's a, and, and it's a, phone it's a very it. thin layer. It's a 2.3 My phone has so. OL, uh, OLED to the Exactly. So. We're all dying right I'm now. I'm just saying, when they first discovered radium, they put it on fucking everything, and then they realized well, yeah, it gives they, you all They cancer, also used to take, so. like, pus and put it in people's mouths to cure things. Like, that's not... That was, like... 300 years before. Yeah. Like, actually, it actually wasn't that far away. <laughs> hey, it was of, literally two hey, centuries ago. <laughs> speaking of two centuries ago, guys, um, we're getting some more live action Pinocchio news. Huh? Uh, this is something, this is one of the things I left off. <laughs> uh, not me. <laughs> not me. Not this guy because they got this playing Jiminy Cricket. And guess who, what? J. It's, it's who you John Oliver. Oh. I don't know. John Oliver. That'd be a that better choice. That's actually uh, choice. It was. Damn it. Somebody started with a J, but it's Joseph <laughs> Gordon. J G L. Joseph, what? The yeah. Hell? Woo. Okay, first of all, we can all agree Pinocchio is the most boring Disney movie. Yes. Okay, maybe the children's I, I story see. was great and people loved it, but it is the worst Disney movie. It's not saying much, but yeah. Yeah, but is it the worst Disney movie when you have J G L as Jimmy Cricket? When you have Tom Hanks, is I your, know he's had your conscience be your guy. Uh, also, Cynthia Erivo is the blue fairy. She's uh, she was in the Outsider. She was the um, uh, the Susan, so lady. when she was Scott Hall or Kevin Nash. Nash. Yeah, I, I should, you know her, should have taken. Is she Scott Hall or Kevin Nash? Though? No, yeah, no, she wasn't. Um, but guys, we're like we we got this movie is coming, and everyone knows how good these live action movies are. And yeah, the sure. crowd goes I watch mild. The whole yeah. Like I give a flying fuck. Disney's just trying to keep ownership of all of these things. Their properties come up and they're like, oh, we'll buy that back again and make it into a movie. Hey, always let your conscience be your guide. Like guys, GGL. let's talk about a something that's a better thing. Okay. Sure, guys. Superman and Lois, fast track for season two. Wait, well, what? I've heard it's doing... 
Okay. It's a, no, not it's it? doing very well. It's actually had the, one of the highest ratings since 2019. So it's like it's almost like the season three of Arrow. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, oh God. basically. Oh, is it a WB thing? It's and almost also, like the first season also of the Legend CW, of Tomorrow. The CW's CW. highest ratings, guys. Oh, good. Yeah. So uh, it's it's a ratings beast right now. Largest app viewing for a new show, um, and uh, it's it's gonna have season two already. So. I mean, Dean get comfortable. You're, if you start watching it, in case, no, no, no. I know. No, uh, Tyler <laughs> did get swole for this. Like he was, he was Superman in uh, the Supergirl show. He sure was. And he was, oh, he was pretty dope. But so, like so now, he's like, do you know, do you know like, the premise geez. of Superman and Lois? By the way, no. So, so basically, the show is about Superman and Lois. Yeah, moving back part. to Smallville with their twin sons that are in their teens. I remember them, something about them having kids, and I was like, okay. And their teens, yeah. Um, Jordan, John Kent and Jordan Kent. Yep. Um, Emmanuel Shikri <laughs> is in this, so. And Emmanuel, Emmanuel yeah. Shikri. Um, Who should have been the lead. Tyler Hochin looks like he's like 20 years old, so it doesn't really make sense. They grade his chin up a little oh, bit. They, they, okay. They up All right, have you watched any of this show? Or I just seen still. Okay, all right. Yeah. But I was like, okay. There's I mean, I, I one the black guy in this, you guys. So that. one black guy. One he delivers the milk guy. in Smallville. Yeah, <laughs> I'm the milkman. Either it's James Olsen, and I'll give you advice. Hey, is it Jimmy Olsen? It's James. Oh. Okay. okay. <laughs> All right, you're cool now. I guess. I, I guess there's just a what is there race. like? Is there a softcore porn in this show? Because that's basically what WBCW uh, is, no, right? No, there's teenage kids. There's going to be no softcore Teen porn. drama. No, and they're totally going to make out. Some guy's going to take his shirt off. Sure, never have sex either, so that's just how that works. They actually are never nudes, I think. Yeah, pretty much. Well, so they moved back to Smallville because they would have to bang with a couple of oh, so, they, so they moved back to Smallville, though, because they're both, like, fired in disgrace of some sort. From the daily, like like whatever they like is like not the write this story, story and they write the DL. Yeah, the DL. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. He's uh, actually working at the DL, <laughs> and that's where they get fired from. He's like, I'll go back to Smallville, I guess. No other jobs in the New York City, <laughs> the New York City of this world. Metro. Um, I'm trying well, to draw well, in this. Metro. Metro. Metropolis. Metro. Metropolis. Metro. 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 And this is probably the most important news. I probably should save it for last, but I'm going to say it for okay. now. We have the six titles for the six chapters of the Snyder Cut, guys. Oh, my oh, God. There's six oh, chapters. What? There's six Can buttons. I tell you guys that when I jokingly brought this up fucking two and a half years ago, when I was like, this is going to happen, and you guys weren't like, were like, this isn't going to happen... I am sad that it's turned into. I think you might have said, "Go fuck yourself." I yeah, seriously. I, I like that part of the drinking game for this podcast is that when you bring up the fact that you brought that up, yeah, that could be a, definitely. Yeah. A, a, a good might be every one of the last like ten episodes. Like, and by the way, did I mention I told you that? Well, just like when I told you guys that the most recent Star Wars movie was gonna have the Skywalker name in it, and you were like, "No, it's not," and then it did. So don't that part. I don't believe that. <laughs> okay, part, <actually>. guys, <laughs> this is go back in history. This movie is twenty as long as the Joss Whedon cut. Yeah, because Joss Whedon don't get good, scrub. Okay, that movie felt like it was six hours long. So this has got to be 12 hours long, I guess. Um, it's well, like, it's seven it's parts, like, right? It's like the six Lord of the Rings, but you hate yourself yeah. the whole time. Um, so here are the, here's the six episodes. You ready? For the I'm six ready. Episodes? Let's do it. Let's do it. Episodes. Chapters. Chapters. It should be episodes, series. but no, they're not. It's one goddamn Cereals. movie with six chapters. Parts. Okay, the first like chapter. Moments. Listen, focus. Fuck. We gotta get through this, guys. Okay. Let's the first it. chapter is. Things left, so. Don't count on it, Batman. The second chapter is the Age of Heroes. By the way, they sound like they're from two complete. One sounds like it's from like a fourth grade bo- a book you read in fourth grade, and the other one sounds like. Like a serious adult novel. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, third one. Beloved mother, beloved son. Now now it's going like deep into like adulthood. Fourth. Change machine. What the? Uh, okay. It's a mother bus. Five. Mother bus. All the hero's horses. Mm. Couldn't put Humpty together. But then, uh, Superman is. What? That's but they do. Superman. But okay. Yeah. Uh, maybe they don't in the, this new version. And the. The, that's the fifth one. And the sixth one is something darker. 
Which is the Let's Martian see. Manhunter's big meaty cock, obviously. Yeah, it's dark side, come on, man. It's, it's Martian Manhunter's big meaty cock. Everyone knows that. I'm so okay, two and a half hours tired. of unseen footage, though. Two and a half hours. This is basically a new movie. I, I think they should start putting, like, instead of unseen footage, but, like, two and a half hours of footage you may want to see. <laughs> yeah. Maybe it'll be Aquaman going, My man! Like, yeah. My man! My man! My man! My man! Like, 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 like a bunch of takes in and saying, My man. <laughs> Maybe his man is Martian Manhunter. They're together in this. Like that is me. I am Martian Manhunter. I'm his man. Uh, Bakrova. So he's he's just uh, he's, he's just uh, mm-hmm. he's closer tracker. tracker right? uh, yeah, Chris. small closer tracker. Yeah. I mean, if we get to see more Amy Adams, I'm always okay with that. So I'm not because she is horrible in that. <laughs> I know. That's She's not terrible. Fault, but... And I you know, know, you watch that movie now. You know, you now you can't say you haven't seen it at this point. It's bad. You know, but... I've never seen. What is that movie she's in where she plays like the princess fairy? Is it Enchant- Enchanted? Enchanted. No, ever After? No, ever it's... After? No, Ever no, After is Enchanted. Drew Barrymore. It's Enchanted. 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 Right. I've never seen that movie. Sorry. I, I mean, That's better than this movie. I thought you were saying Arrival. I was like, oh. Right. Did she, yeah, yeah. I've never seen Arrival where she's a princess. <laughs> yeah. The princess that <laughs> just talks the to the princess of, the hu- of, of humans. With, 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 yeah. with seven with strength, arms, I yeah. guess. Because that's the thing. Yeah. And sometimes, right? I mean, um, you can do a lot with stuff. Guys, I have some, I have the best news. And okay, I'm, for last. I'm, I'm ready glad, for the best I'm news. I'm glad this will save for last, because I have two different things. Yeah, okay. And they're very different. Okay. So, you, oh my God. so I'm going to let you guys choose. Would you rather have this? Choose your own? Okay. No, I don't. So I don't either choose, this. you get to choose a real life, real world, the real physics world? phenomenon, like astronomical phenomenon. Oh, or, I like that. Or, Sony's bullshit. <laughs> Sony's no more bullshit. Sony. So, Wait, serious? Sony? Sony's Sony? Sony's gonna PS5 Sony bullshit. Sony, oh, PS5, okay. PS5 bullshit. Okay, so PS5 bullshit. So Sony, the, and this is gonna, I, and you're gonna regret this because you want, you're like, we should say this last. Sony has patented ways of turning bananas and other objects into controllers for PlayStation. <laughs> I'm, I'm all in. I'm in. So, so in the future, if you're like, hey, we only have one controller for my PlayStation Five. Hold on. How about I this? Mean, this is my, yeah, no, seriously. My first thought was like, what do you do with a banana that you can? Well, maybe you have to control banana control. Does it have to be a like, piece of fruit, or can it be like a dildo? You can just change the dildo. So it, it's it can what be. I'm saying. It, what, in a this also why I put. Way. This also why I put <laughs> mugs and other stuff in here. Right. Uh, so it, you you just need a camera, which the PS5 does not come with. For the just record. need a camera. A camera that connects to your PS5. They have that mm. new VSR, and yeah. it, it scans the non-luminous object. And then you use the. You what use, makes it non luminous? It, 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 it can be shiny. You can't have a shiny eye. So okay. you can't, like, I use this beer bottle. It's make it shiny, I'll shine the laser back. It's too shiny. shiny. Um, so you use this, like, right? Like. Yeah, yeah, that could work. Uh, so basically, it tracks your fingers on the object, and that's where it puts the. It basically, like, places yeah, the like buttons. That. Makes sense. That does like, and so you can, like you can play, like, and a. You can already do that with, like, keyboards. They have those keyboards that can. Kind of project and it tracks your finger movement to, to do the keyboard stuff. But Sony didn't patent that shit. So how long till we're just um like floating along on chairs, like reclined constantly and doing everything in our brains? So basically, the plot of Wally is. Yeah, exactly. Like, That's exactly <laughs> what I meant. That is our future. So I'm sure, why not? As long as I get to have a banana controller and yeah. and that Slurpee thing that they drink all the time. Yeah, like meatloaf Slurpee. Oh. Yeah, I'm in. His name is Robert Paulson, but okay. <laughs> um, so the, the last thing, guys, and this is also great. Uh, we just uh, confirmed that there was a space hurricane above the North Pole. Mm-hmm. That's, that's cool. We need that. And so if you're like, <clears throat> that's terrifying. Uh, it was confirmed by Shandong University research team that observed the magnetosphere basically swirling around and uh, just raining electrons all, uh, all over the North Pole. It's probably not good. I mean, I mean much I like the someone... happening, I'm on the side of Mother Earth when she's like, I'm ready to yeah, get Yeah, I guess it's like we're done at this point. Yeah. I'm hoping that some, that like a polar bear can like shoot lasers out of his eyes at this point. At least from that. Yeah, no. A polar bear can shoot lasers and kill all the humans. And then polar bears you get to live, right? You just said shirt. That was great. I know, I'm so I know. I know. I mean, are we in the good place? Well, you can tell us all you want. This fork. You can no. you want here, it's fine. No, except that we're really in the bad place, you guys. That's what yeah, we're talking about. It's called, it's called the Earth ending. It's called America. And then, yeah. Um, ooh, ooh. Yeah, so, I mean, cool, right? Space hurricanes? That's great. 
That was a it made plasma. Plasma look pretty cool. It's really plasma just really. Yeah, but the thing us. is, Miguel, this shit this speech. shit has been happening around us for thousands of years and it will continue for thousands and millennia more. Like we're just a tiny Once we're, dust. we're a tiny little speck in the whole giant universe that is around us. So Get a room, Buddha. <laughs> yeah. Am I right? I did though, like I was thinking about that show and I'm like really this does prove Buddhism because they're like then the good in the bad place we're gonna work to get better in the good place and in the good place we just get bored so we need to work to get better and it's like humans need also challenge the good place or else actually oh my god they were great yeah they were great it was great yeah I am here for this I love Paul Shear in everything he summoned something else recently and was like Shear yep everything Shear setting Shear Andre okay. guys. Andre, thanks, so you guys. Thank you. We you drank our beers. All three people. We talk about this. dirty stuff. We love we you. We talk about dirty things. Stay classy. Bye bye.